We're here back in the Fantasy Bible League Wednesday night in the NBA. we got six of my favorite plays on FanDuel and DraftKings, including a couple guys in mid-range I think are too cheap. My favorite value play on the board. we got some correlations for you. And, of course, my favorite play of the night. Who are we talking about? Belly up to the Fantasy Barn. Find out. Welcome in, guys. Wednesday edition Beers Daily Fantasy Six Pack. Good to be back in the Fantasy Bar once again. Talking NBA Six of my favorite plays for this big Wednesday night slate. Thank you, as always, for stopping by and hanging out here in the Fantasy Bar. Now, before we get into the plays, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. That's the tip jar here on these videos. Thank you for that. Subscribe to the channel. Don't miss any of the content NFL videos going out. My pints and picks videos. Two of my favorite NFL bets, nine and one. Over the last five weeks, so make sure you are checking it all out. Subscribe, don't miss any of it, and check out scoresandodds.com slash beer. That link in the description of the video. Tons of great sports betting information over there. All right, let's jump into the plays for tonight. Let's start at point guard, shooting guard with Jordan Poole of Golden State. Now, we know the Warriors without Steph Curry, Andrew Wiggins, Clay Thompson going to join them on the sideline. So, Jordan Poole, just the guy we got to cram into lineups tonight. They're going to need his offense here in this spot against Brooklyn. 20 or more points now for Jordan Poole in nine of the last 10 games. We know 50 point upside, not out of the question here against this Brooklyn Nets team who have really struggled against guard. Fourth most points allowed to this position that matches up well with Poole. Fifth most fantasy points allowed. I think we see a big ceiling game here out of Jordan Poole. Gotta get him in those lineups tonight with all those guys on the shelf. All right, let's stay at point guard, shooting guard next with Markel Fultz of Orlando. So to me, one of the best buy lows out there right now in the mid range, minutes are up, production starting to go up. We saw that big game the other night and we've seen a couple ceiling games out of him here recently, two games of 47 or more DraftKings points in just the last week alone. So coming off of that injury, starting to get more confident, starting to put those numbers back on the board here, Orlando could definitely use some help outside of Paolo Bancaro. Some Pultz kind of stepping in, filling that bill here, especially with Jalen Suggs on the shelf right now. And what a matchup he gets here. You don't get much better matchup as a guard than the Houston Rockets giving up the most fantasy points, two point guards this season. Markel Fultz, price is going to shoot up, I promise you. Buy low here while we can tonight against the Houston Rockets. All right, speaking of Houston, let's go to that side of things with some value at small forward, power forward, with Tari Eason. This guy's been impressive when given minutes, and I think the minutes are certainly gonna stay around here, averaging almost 24 per game here over the last two. So anytime I can get a guy that can threaten 25 minutes at a sub 4K price point on DraftKings, I wanna take advantage. And Eason, a guy we can do that here tonight. Now, when you look at the pricing range, guys in this range, there's not many guys here that can give you a 30, 35 fantasy point day. Eason has shown us that multiple times this season so huge ceiling here potential of a 9 10x output for a guy like Eason and better yet the price is as low as we've seen all season long on DraftKings cheapest price take advantage Tari Eason tonight against the Orlando Magic all right let's move to center next with Nikola Vucevic of Chicago so here's another guy that stood out in the pricing department second lowest price we've seen on him all season long on DraftKings something you should certainly be taking advantage of and keeping an eye on throughout the season so Vooch Buy and low here in a good matchup here and playing well. 39 or more DraftKings points in six of the last nine games. Atlanta has struggled with centers, and that was with Clint Capella. Him on the shelf, I think it's a great matchup for Vooch to do some damage down low. Double-double certainly within the realm of possibilities here, and I think 50-point upside within the range here as well. Atlanta bottom 10 in fantasy production allowed to the center position. I think Vooch stays hot here by low on this cheap DraftKings price. All right, back to point guard, shooting guard. Anthony Melton of Philadelphia. So great value on FanDuel tonight. Anytime you see the prices right around each other, FanDuel is the way you want to go here. Not that you can't play him on DraftKings, but 6,300 feels a tad cheap here. And coming off a rough game the other night, didn't shoot the ball very well. Fantasy production obviously wasn't there. So people may steer away from that. The old, what have you done for me lately? But this guy's upside in tournaments is definitely what we're after here. Multiple times this season, we've seen some massive games out of the Anthony Melton. In fact, you saw that big, Almost 60 burger against the Lakers. Many games he's given us 40 plus fantasy points. I think he can do that here against Detroit. Whether he's at the point guard, the shooting guard position does not matter here tonight. Detroit bottom five against both of those positions. The Anthony Mountain, great value over on Fandle, still playable on DraftKings. Fantastic matchup here with the Detroit Pistons. All right, it's time. You take a look at my favorite play for Wednesday night. Before we do that, let's run it back with our Beast of the Night contest. Easy to play. 
All you got to do, get in the comment section right below the video and guess fantasy points on FanDuel tonight. The closest guest is going to win themselves a free week of Roto Grinders Premium. Chance to check it all out behind the scenes. All right, let's take a look at my favorite play for Wednesday night. You know, Mass, the beast of the night. All right, beast time. One more point guard shooting guard here with Shea Gilgis Alexander of the Thunder. Tonight's beast of the night. Now we know Josh Giddy not going to go tonight in this game against Portland. That's good news for SGA. Not that he needs any more usage than what he already has in this offense, but usage does take a jump up to almost 4%, up to almost 35%. So some huge numbers here for SGA. Just has the ball in his hands, an absolute ton for this Oklahoma City team. An elite matchup here, head to head with fellow star point guard Damian Lillard. So that one should be fun. Can pair those two up in some lineups here tonight. And the production being about as bankable as you could imagine. Only one game in the last 13 as this guy dropped under 40 fantasy points. In fact, he's top 52 or more fantasy points in three of the last four games. I think 50 is the floor here tonight. I think this guy could get you 60 plus fantasy points. Shea Gilgis, Alexander, my favorite play on the board and tonight's beast of the night. All right, guys, that'll do it for Wednesday night with six of my favorite plays on FanDuel and DraftKings. If you have any comments, questions, feedback, don't hesitate. Hit me up in that comment section right below the video. Don't forget, fantasy points for SGA on FanDuel for your shot at some free Roto Grinders premium. I want to know who your top play is on this slate as well. Who's your beast of the night? Sound off in that YouTube comment section. If you haven't already, click the thumbs up button, subscribe to the channel, and go check out scoresandodds.com slash beer. That link in the description of the video. For rotogrinders.com, I am Beer saying salut, guys. Thank you so much for watching. NFL videos coming hopefully tomorrow, so keep an eye on that. Good luck tonight, and we'll see you. Hey, thanks for checking out our videos. If you want more expert advice on DraftKings, FanDuel, or any other daily fantasy sports, make sure you check out the current videos playlist.